So here we have Lilio, Catlia, Little Susie, Brighty, Stacy, AMAOS. And we are here at the Old Dominion University at the Kaplan Market Conservatory. And I was just walking by uh, from the gym and so tired from using the elliptical. But need to relax for a little bit so i went into the conservatory and look we found flowers so here is the leliocatlia and it has very purple uh and dark lips purple petals um this should be by the way the vanda sanderiana so yeah it's not quite a big plant so but still it's a little beautiful plant and so yeah, so there are a lot of tropical plants inside the conservatory, and uh, yeah, I was just walking through and taking some video footage inside the <coughs> greenhouse. So I was surprised that I was good thing that I looked down and then I saw this bulbophyllum. I think this is the bulbophyllum pelinopsis because it's so huge and the flowers are unmis unmistakably. It looks like the bulb of phalaenopsis. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. Let me know in the comment section or something. And it has a little bit of a stink to it, but not so bad. I guess it's not so fresh anymore. So I guess when it was fresher, it would have been like a more stinkier smell. And it's quite big, as you could see. See, that's my foot. Yeah. And, um,. The, the those leaves should be about like two three, three, wow well, no it's, it should be like three feet or something so i was just looking down and then i saw a bush with some small flowers and yeah i like the markings the purple markings and the white background so there you go and so what do we have here yeah i don't know what this is but it's like freaky it looks like Halloween when I was looking at it and I don't know what those are but I think those are the seeds or something and it kind of freaked me out but you know keep on going it took some videos of it yeah it, it's 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 stunning at the same time a bit uh, scary creepy um, this is like your typical dendrovium pelinopsis orchid bijibum bijibum or well, I don't know what how you pr pronounce that but yeah this is what you, you get from some of your garden centers and then that's a, a bromeliad there with its um uh, i don't know if you could can call it flower yeah and yeah there's another one there far back there on a on a bench and uh, what else what do we have here yeah yeah that's a huge plant there and I think this is another, oh yeah, so it's another, uh, could be a Leliocatlia hybrid of some sort. I'm not really sure. Yeah, there's like a tag there, but so far away, I cannot really like read it well. I hope you got that. And yeah, nice foliage. And this is another one. I'm not really sure what it is, but it kind of looked like an Oncidium but um yeah it has like this the, those brassia uh characteristics that you would find from you know those spider orchids and but the the pseudobulbs kind of look like you know uh, encyclia or some sort but i'm not really sure you have to let me know about that one this is another dendro dendrogen pelinopsis with um dark purple markings well not markings there's just dark purple okay so here we go in the second half um so here are staghorn ferns and there's like a small dinosaur there there as you can see like made of ceramic i don't know i was just fascinated about that one and then the, here you go i saw another <coughs> orchid um, it kind of looks like the bracteosum but i'm not really sure because it's orange because bracteosum i remember are purple pink right Something like that but yeah let me know also in the comment section more ferns and yet the, this is like the wall full of dendrobiums there's so many of them uh, I'm not really sure about this one I think this is a bulbophyllum of some sort 
Yeah, I should have like checked the tag or something. Yeah, it's a Bulba film, I think. And another plant that I don't know of, there's no tag with it, so I was not able to identify it. There was nobody around to uh, help me, like to, so you could like give them questions or something like that if you have many questions about the plants. But it's, it's, you're all on your own when you're inside the conservatory. So, yeah, so if you're in the area, Virginia Beach or, you know, the Hampton Roads area, try this, check this place out. There's so many dendrobium signs on this wall. And I hope they, they, they give like tours or something because um, it's quite a quite nice collection. And they have more plants inside. This is just a display area. So this is not like all of their plants. This is just like a fraction of the, all the plants available. And that ends basically the tour of the conservatory. And hopefully I will be able to participate in a tour pretty soon in this in this place uh, I'm, I was trying to contact the, uh, the person in charge but so far I had no luck in being able to being able to uh, have it uh, have a correspondence with the guy I'll try again I mean perhaps I would call this time too and there you go so if you are in the area or anything like that I mean make sure that you you, you drop by and take a visit I guess and um, that's pretty much it. Thank you for subs for watching my video and subscribe to my channel, by the way. If you want to see more videos like this, I will try to upload videos mm, almost every day. I'll try. And um, to all my orchid growing friends, happy growing and have a great day. Bye-bye.